Oh, it's awesome. Uh, it's been a long time coming. Adam Brazil spent 12 years in prison for a murder he did not commit. Now fully exonerated by Governor Bill Lee, he says he wants his story to give hope to others wrongfully accused. He tells 10 News reporter Cole Sullivan he feels like he's gone from living a nightmare to living a fairy tale. 38 year old Adam Brazil can't help but smile. It's been something that, you know, I'd hoped I'd hear uh, for a very, very long time. He calls his a story of hope, but when you hear it, it can be hard to understand how Brazil can be so happy. There's been a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of ups and downs in the case. Ups and downs that led the state to wrongfully imprison him for 12 years for a murder in Grundy County that he didn't commit. It really sounded like there were some serious holes in the case. Former reporter Matt Lakin covered Brazil's story for the Knoxville News Sentinel. Adam had red hair and the sergeant on the scene who discovered Malcolm Burroughs' body said, who around here has red hair? A jury convicted him. One court then let him out and another court put him back in. There's things that you have control over and there's things you don't. Then a random TBI fingerprint search confirmed someone else was at the scene of the crime. Adam would say it was a miracle. A miracle when he answered a call from Governor Bill Lee Thursday and learned of his total exoneration. While we were speaking, he got final word from his lawyer. It says that it's confirmed that I'm good to go, restoration of all my rights. Now free and living in Jacksboro with his wife Raquel, he wants to keep sharing his story. It's a story of hope. Uh, it should motivate people to never give up. And fight until injustice is made right. Reporting from Knoxville, I'm Cole Sullivan. Brazil says he wants to focus on his family and his job. He also wants to thank his attorneys and supporters who fought for him.